Oh, hey y'all, it's Andy. Um, sitting there in the shop, I got a couple of free seconds, so I figured I would make me um, my own little uh, homemade leather stroke to keep all my knives sharp and stuff. So, anyways, let me get this here camera turned around, and I'm gonna. Well, I figured I'd show y'all how I'm gonna do it and take y'all along for the ride. So, give me a second, and I'll be right back with y'all. Oh, all right, y'all. Here's all we got. Just an old leather belt that I found that has seen better days that I don't even know what happened to the buckle on it or what, but just an old leather belt, just an old scrap piece of wood that's been split up that ain't good for nothing. Some glue, and I got some clamps right over here for in a second. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our piece of wood and our glue here and get a good bead of glue going on there. There we go. We're going to set our leather belt on here and give it a good pressing. There we go. And if a little, a little bit of glue squeezes out, that's alright y'all. I'd rather have too much glue than not enough. And now, we're just going to take our clamps and clamp her down on here right like this and don't be afraid there ain't never no such thing as too many clamps y'all there we go this one right here And one more at this end. Alright. Now it is all clamped up. I'm going to let this here glue dry. And I will bring y'all back when I'm taking the clamps off. And of course y'all, you know the baby girl dog's in here helping. And making sure nothing gets me. <laughs> well she says hey y'all. Alright y'all, just got the clamps took off after gluing a leather belt on here. And now what we're going to do is we're going to take her handy dandy little just throw it around, break it if I ain't worried about a shop knife, and cut her flush. Oh, get off the wood there. There we go. Cut this side. And there we go, y'all. A homemade leather stroke for after you're through with your whetstone or Arkansas stone or whatever you use to sharpen your knife. Just take it and polish out the edges there with the leather just like any store-bought leather stroke well anyways let me get this here camera turned back around and I'll be back with y'all here in just a second well all right y'all figure I'll <clears throat> excuse me figure I'll end out the video here um, it is dark outside and it is a little bit after 8 o'clock in the evening and I'm tired so, I said, hope you enjoyed the video of the little homemade do-it-yourself leather stroke. So, thank you all for watching. God bless. Hope you all have a good day. And I will see you all on the next video.